Hello guys, it is Mr. Strickler. I hope you guys enjoyed the new intro. And yeah, today we are here with the Impala SC. It's based on 99 Imp Impala. I forgot what, oh yeah, 99. And this car um, is really close to the real life car. I'm sorry if I'm speaking loud. Um, oh, Vincent. Alright, so well, got the Impala SC here, it's based on 99 Impala, let's go straight to customize, and this car, um, has came with three colors, so yeah, a, like a dark green, a black, and a cherry red, alright, that's what kind of customization this has, so armor, brakes, bumpers, I'm not really a fan of this bumper though, yeah, I'm not going to go for that rear bumper. Bumper delete and touring? It's maybe some weird to say, but I prefer the touring bumper over the stock. But I'm not going to put that on. Engine exhaust. Yeah, but can you drag exhaust? I mean, this may sound weird to say, but I do like the chrome big bore exhaust. Front diffuser, carbon canner, it's carbon splitter, carbon... Nah, we're not going to go over that. Grill, chrome bars, painted grill, oh, whoops, chrome grill, and classic grill. For which one was the real one? I think the real one is painted, if I'm correct. So we're going to go for painted, headlights, red, green, blue, yellow. Don't know how to pronounce that, but it's like a rainbow. We're not going to go for any hood lifted hood so it's like a bigger bulge on the hood twin vented a little bit it's it's all right sport hood this is like uh wait which one yeah this one is like a camaro hood i forgot which camaro it was but yeah i think i'm gonna go for lifted hood uh later we're gonna leave stock livery uh we got that we got that again Okay, this one, red half tone, doesn't look that bad. But, oh, classic stripes. Pincher, where's the pinstripe? Oh, so it's like a low rider. Yeah, we're not going to go for any livery. Uh, plate, we are going to do my... Uh, wait, this could be a stance car, so yeah, we're going to put it on our stance plate. Rear diffuser. Yeah, we're not putting any diffuser on. Respray. So here's the hex code right now. Um, this color is called P Pewter. Um, P E W T E R. And I forgot what person it said, so I'm just going to choose a person that I like. No, no. And my game is lagging. Alright. Um, let's find a person that does look a little bit good. I want like a little bit of a bright pearl, so. Should I do a diamond blue pearl? If I have an unlock? Where's diamond blue? Yeah, diamond blue is a perfect color. Alright. Sun strips, primary, secondary carbon. We're not going for that. Spoiler. Low level tip. Duck. Uh, wait, whoops. Duck tail wing. What? Heck. Sport wing from the Kinjo SJ, track wing from the Omnis EGT, and drag wing from the uh, Kuruma. Personally, I'm going to go for the low level tip. Suspension. I heard you could slam this, like it barely goes down now, but you can slam it. Transmission, turbo, and wheels. Ooh, the Giga Mesh though. Oh, but this is like a modern wheel. Asters in chrome. There you go. Guess we're going for that. And then, uh, windows. Do we really want to doubt this? I mean, we could, but I'm not going to. So, yeah, there's the car. I'll meet you guys outside. Oh, 
Alright, so here we are outside, and yeah, I'm... Well, let's listen to the sound of the car. Sounds like an average GTA car. Let's see the interior. Yeah, an old uh, GTA car interior. Not much to say. Alright, let's see how fast this thing is. Off the go, it's pretty good. Um, I feel like I may uh, not keep this car. Uh, cause like, look at the wheel gap uh, for the rear fender. Like, look at that. It's not the greatest. And then for the front, they did perfect. You're like, Rockstar, fix the offset on this wheel. You guys always seem to screw up something on every single car. But yeah, 1.2 million? This car is way worth it than the Range Rover, in my opinion. It may not have the customization of like a Moni Tech or anything, but to me, this is really worth it. So, for 1.2 million, or near enough 1.3 million, I say get it, it's worth it, and that person just ran into me when I was driving, but it's very much worth it. And for 99 Impala, heck yeah, buy it. But there may be some things you don't like. There may, like me, I don't like the rear wheel offset. But, you know, it, other than that, it's a pretty good car. Would I rather this over the Impala? I mean, uh, the Range Rover? I would rather this over the Range Rover. Because the Range Rover is just too expensive. People would be like, oh, the Range Rover is so cheap. And 1.7 plus Amani Tech upgrades and all your other upgrades... It's not really worth it. But this thing has no money tech, and I'd say buy it if you're looking for an old Impala. That's a four door. And yeah, I say buy it. Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and have a great day or a good night. And I'll see you guys later in the next video. And if I'm streaming, uh, that'll be that'll be I think next week. Uh, yeah, next week on Saturday or Sunday. So watch out for streams coming up. I may be streaming through my PS5 because I might be at my dad's. So, yeah, just make sure you just keep watching out for videos, streams, YouTube shorts, maybe a beach channel may be coming up soon where I may be uploading it to an Elite Kim Over 94 channel. So, yeah, peace out. I hope you guys had a great day. I'll talk to you later. Mr. Strickler is now out. Peace out. Enjoy.